welcome back to my channel. I am Diamond76, Home Decor on a Budget. And thank you for joining me for today's video. Now, um, for today's video, I'm just going to show you a few updates that I decided to make in my home. And you can see me right there in the mirror. Where I am standing at, I am standing on... Well, this is where you come into my front door and I have the door cracked so that way you can um, have a little bit of lighting and that's where you go down the stairs into the garage. Now, what you see in front of you is a mirror that I had put here when I did the, when I painted my home and did the updates to the walls and everything and what you're looking at is like I said when you come up the stairs and this is something that I have in front of me you see the baskets um it was brown so I spray painted it white this is where people are supposed to put their shoes and they do not sometimes but um they do slide out but anyway, this is how I chose to decorate my entryway. And um, all I did was I put two white glass pumpkins right here. And I'm trying to get my camera to focus. There we go. And it's going out. Let me get a little closer. Let me open my door a little bit. Okay, there we go. What I decided to do was I decided to put uh, three LED candles right here. I took a plant and I stuck it inside of a uh, pot. Um, I can't remember where I got this pot from, but it is um, has a stand. Um, I hope that you can see that, that it is sitting on. What I decided to do was I got these two candle holders from the at-home store and I, instead of putting candles on them, I decided to put these on here. They just lift up and I just stuck those on there for the holidays. And this is what this looks like. Now I'm getting ready to show you something um, because um, you don't have to have all of this here, but I'm getting ready to uh, go up so I can show you something. Now, for your entryway, I just hung this there uh, because I wanted to give you an example of what you can hang on a mirror in your entryway. And I chose to hang this right here. And as you can see, my ceiling goes all the way up. And the reason why I hung that right there, because I wanted to give you an example of what you can do when you have a tall ceiling like I have right here. And um, I am going to move that, or either I'm going to keep that there and just move this right here. Tell me what you think in the comment section below. I would love to hear your thoughts and opinions on this. But like I said, um, I just wanted to come to you to show you what I did do to my entryway and the changes that I did make. And behind me, you do see a sign. <laughs> well, not a sign, but um, a picture that says home is where I am with you. And I keep that hung right there. And the reason why I hung that picture frame behind me is so that it will reflect and you can see it through the mirror. Now, like I said, this plant right here is not real. Um, really, basically everything up here is fall. And be because I do have the grandkids coming into the home, I didn't want to put real candles right here. And let me move on to show you the other updates that I did do. Okay, I am back with my second update on my home. Now, what I did was um, I wanted to spruce up my uh, coffee and hot cocoa station just a little bit. I am going to decorate it a little bit more for the uh, holidays that are coming up. But I didn't want to put too much right here because of the simple fact is that I don't have a lot of room right here. And my husband has... Um, uh, uh, like a small little oven for his pizzas and stuff on this side right here so I didn't want to put too much all I did was I added a pumpkin right here on a tray and 
three little small pumpkins. I took my, um, these, uh, Keurig, uh, hot chocolate, uh, um, and I put them in here in a clear glass right here. Now, I didn't want to put marshmallows in here or the, um, the, I can't think of the name of them, but they're, they're, have, they're sticks, they have swirl and they have chocolate in them. I didn't want to put these in here simply because I have grandbabies. And because I have grandbabies, they will be gone in a day. And what I also did was I brought in some faux flowers um, that I had gotten from the Dollar Tree last year. And I just stuck them in a container and stuck them right here just to bring in a little bit of rib. And these are the containers that I do have the marshmallows in. And this one right here will house the sticks that I plan on getting that you can stick into your um, hot chocolate. And I can't think of the name of them. If you know the name of them, please let me know. And what I did was I kept the Keurig uh, right here. And I have these cups with the letter J uh, for my last name, and I only have two. I usually keep them upside down right here, along with other cups, and it will, along with other cups on top of a tray. And that is simply because um, I don't want to have a whole bunch of cups. Um, I just only wanted to add a few cups right here, and these are bigger. Um, for the days when I am really, really, really cold, um, and I need something hot, so these cups are really bigger. Um, and I, I can't remember where I got these from. I'm not sure if I got these from TJ Maxx, um, as well as the tray. But this is basically how I set this up. I didn't want it to seem too cluttery. Um, I just wanted it to look nice. But I do plan on bringing in, as, as we get closer to uh, Thanksgiving and Christmas, I do plan on putting some garland down here to dress this up a little bit more. I basically just kept this uh, as neutral as possible. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to my last um, update that I did make to my home. And stick with me, I'll be right back. Okay, I am back for my last update to my home. Now, what I did was I purchased this vase right here. And I think I got this from Burlington. And it was, I got on glasses and still can't see. It was $14.99. And what I did was I went to Michael's because I knew that I wanted to put something tall right here. I do have a circle uh, a round mirror right here and I think I got this from Kohl's and I did do a, a haul on this right here what I decided to do was I got these uh, these reddish looking leaves right here and I decided to stick them in the vase with the peonies the cream color and I got these from Michaels as well and what I liked it about this was the tallness of the vase the um, leaves that are coming out at the at the bottom that are also matching the leaves up here. I just kept this the way I had it originally. And all I did was just changed out the fern that I had right here. And I just kept the blue candles that I have in a glass right here that I gotten from the dollar store. And I just stuck them on here just like that and this tray i it's not a tray well it's, it kind of reminds you of a tray i got this from oh lord i can't even remember i think i got oh i got this from the at home store <laughs> i had to look under the bottom but i did get this from the at home store and i just stuck this right here what i wanted when i walked down the hallway i wanted to see uh, different textures like this vase right here the different the uh, the sparkles and the different design and this and this right here the you know the different design in that 
And what I did was I went on ahead and kept my candles, uh, their ombre, as you can see. And I just stuck them in a Dollar Tree glass. And I like the fact that I kept this on here because I don't burn these. This is gold right here, as you can see. So, I kind of have a, a mixture of really silver, white, and a little bit of gold, and more silver, and this is gold. So, I felt like mixing it would be perfect, and because the mirror is trimmed in gold, I thought it would be a perfect place for me to be able to mix the metals, like the gold, the silver, um, and then throw in the white. Now, I did leave this plain. Now, if I want to, I can stick something in here, but I don't want to. I think it would take away from the flowers that I have right here for the holidays. So, when I come down the hallway, you know, it gives me that wow and that bang factor. And my bedroom is right here, and I have my office right here. So it gives me that wild factor when I come down the hall or when I come out of my bedroom or when I come out of my office. And the reason why I keep my office closed is because I have a, a, a printer in there and I don't want the grandkids in there messing with it. So I do keep this door closed right here. And that is up for, that is it up, that is it for my updates. And I hope that you enjoyed the updates. And I plan on bringing you some more updates to my home um, as it gets closer to the Thanksgiving and as it gets closer to Christmas. And I can't wait for Christmas um, because I always put a tree in my beauty room downstairs. Hopefully... My puppy won't destroy the tree, but we're going to see. Um, that is it for my channel. And again, my name is Diamond76, home decor on a budget. Uh, let me know in the comment sections below um, what you think of the simple updates that I made to my home. And always, always remember to put that diamond touch on anything that you decide to do in your home and if you're new to my channel please subscribe to my channel I would love to have you I mean wait a minute please subscribe to my channel I would love to have you on my channel and don't forget to click that bell for any video uploads or any video notifications and if you want to you can join me on my Instagram at diamond 2872 I would love to have you there and um I think, oh, and if you're an old subscriber returning, thank you, and I really appreciate that, and you got to excuse me because I am rushing before my grandkids get home, and again, um, I hope that everyone is having a good day or a good evening, and I will talk to you later in my next video. 